The present study employed fMRI to examine the neural systems used to reappraise highly negative scenes. Reappraisal is a coping strategy in which patients are taught to monitor and evaluate negative thoughts and replace them with more positive thoughts and images. The ability to cognitively regulate emotional responses to aversive events is important for mental and physical health. However, little is known about the neural basis of the cognitive control of emotion. The researchers' hypothesis was that the prefrontal cortex is involved in constructing reappraisal strategies that can modulate activity in multiple emotion processing systems. The researchers recruited 15 healthy right-handed females from Stanford to participate in the experiment. Participants were shown two sets of 38 negative color photos and one set of 38 neutral color photos. At the beginning of each trial, a photo appeared in the center of a black screen. The photo was either a neutral photo, like this living room, or a negative photo, like this crying baby. The photo appeared for four seconds with the instruction view printed in white underneath. Many photos depicted complex scenes, and during this viewing period, participants were instructed to view the photo, understand its content, and allow themselves to experience or feel any emotional responses it might elicit. The photo remained on the screen for an additional four seconds with an instruction either to attend or reappraise, replacing the instruction to view. On attend trials, either a negative or a neutral photo was shown, and participants were instructed to attend to and be aware of, but not to try to alter, any feelings elicited by it. On reappraised trials, a negative photo was shown, and participants were instructed to reinterpret the photo so that it no longer elicited a negative response. The four-second time period during which participants were attending or reappraising negative photos is a subject of the functional imaging analysis reported in the present study. The photo then disappeared and, for 3.1 seconds, participants could continue attending to or reappraising any feelings that lingered after its presentation. A four-point scale for rating the strength of current negative affect then was presented for three seconds, and participants indicated how they felt currently. Finally, an instruction to relax appeared in the center of the screen for five seconds. The study found that reappraisal regions of the brain were identified by greater activation in response to the most negative photos on reappraised trials than on attend trials. Consistent with the researchers' predictions, activated regions included the left lateral prefrontal cortex and the dorsal medial prefrontal cortex. Significant activity was observed in the right amygdala during the attend trials, but not the reappraised trials. In the amygdala, the response to the most negative photos on the reappraised trial was no different than the response to neutral photos on the attend trials. These findings are consistent with the fact that the amygdala is central for fear processing.